Hello everybody and welcome to Excel Made Easy. Uh, this is your Excel Guru now with a new formula called sum ifs. Yes, it is sum ifs. Let me tell you what does it do. We'll see what does Excel has to say about it. Sum ifs. Add the cells specified by a given set of conditions or criteria. Uh, criteria is also multiple criteria is also called as criterion. So yes, this is what it does is key when you want to do totals and you would like Excel to do totals for you based on specific conditions or criteria like if I'm taking an example of here say data 1 till data 9 is the range for which I would like to do a total and the condition should be that condition 1 should be that over here we should have 2 and condition 2 should be that opposite 2 there should be a corresponding value of yes so now if we have two and a yes corresponding to it, only then it should total. So these are the examples. Now we have to do some formatting for this to use uh, conditional, uh, sorry, to use some ifs. Uh, the uh, prime concern regarding this would be, sorry, the prime thing regarding to be kept in mind would be that some ifs formula does not uh, add multiple columns at a time it can only add one column so we have to give it a total of the range so I'm doing sum and I'm totaling my range over here row wise so I'm gonna copy this formula till here so this is one pre-formatting that we need to do okay now we can do a formula now we'll start with is equal to s u m i f s bracket open it says sum range so we have to give the total range over here yes correct comma and then it says criteria range one so this is my criteria range one i have named it condition one uh, what condition would i like i have like to have say i would like to have uh, the condition called five comma and then it says criteria range two so this is my criteria range two and it has a combination of yes and no i take a yes now what would excel read do is it will go over here and check for condition one that how many columns rows have sorry how many rows have five over here and how many rows have a corresponding yes to it and if they find fives corresponding with a yes they'll do it will do a total now the result is zero why because here comes five but there is no corresponding yes if i make it yes now see the result has come isn't it cool it's a nice formula uh, i'll teach it to it to, it to you in a, another manner also uh, what you have to do is you can go to the formula tab insert function and type in the name of a formula s u m i f s click on go and here it comes some ifs some range again as we know is the formatted column or row and then comes criteria one my criteria one range is this and my criteria this time i'll take say a six sorry a six over here and then i'll go to criteria range two and this range two is this range and criteria i'll take it as another yes and i'll click on ok and here's the result see six yes 40 i'll make this a six also see and here you have the result is 80 isn't it a nice formula it is uh remember to do the pre-formatting and then it will give you the results the excel file used in this video is available at my website excelmadeeasy.weebly.com all you need to do is go to this website and click on this training files link and download the file for free no do, no question asks and yes one thing i'll ask you to do is uh, not for downloading the file though uh, when you go to my web page if you scroll down you'll see my links for twitter facebook and youtube now i'll ask you if you believe or if you think that what i'm doing is right if you believe that sharing knowledge is good then i will ask you to go ahead and click on twitter click on twitter and follow me over there not only follow but retweet if you believe that what i'm doing is right then do click on my facebook link and like us over there not only like 
but also share my content share my content with other, your friends and if you believe that you would like to if you think that you would like to uh, be uh, made aware whenever i'll upload a new video which is almost every day and then you can choose to subscribe to me on youtube yes you can subscribe to me on youtube and whenever there is a new video launched by me youtube would uh, make you aware by sending a email to you and it will also be easier for you to find me on youtube so this was your excel guru now signing off for the day have a wonderful day ahead happy excel learning ये जो वीडियो आप देख रहे हैं ये और इसके जैसे बहुत सारे वीडियो अवेलेबल है मेरे वेबसाइट माई ई लेसन डॉट ओ आर जी पे यहाँ पे जाके आप उनको देख सकते हैं कुछ ट्रेनिंग फाइल्स भी हैं जिनको आप डाउनलोड कर सकते हैं साथ में ही इस वीडियो के बारे में अगर आपके कुछ क्वेश्चंस हो तो आप जरूर यहाँ पे कमेंट्स में लिखिएगा मैं आपको जवाब दूंगा और अगर आपको ये वीडियो अच्छा लगा है तो जरूर लाइक कीजिए और चैनल को सब्सक्राइब जरूर कीजिएगा उम्मीद करता हूँ की वीडियो आपको पसंद आया होगा अगले वीडियो तक के लिए दिस इज योर गुरु नाव Signing off for the day. Have a wonderful day ahead. Happy learning.